Being the ambassador of WWF, it's a uh, it's a dream come true for me. Um, I've always been uh, involved and in love with the environment. Uh, grew up in nature, and uh, I'm glad I get to uh, use that love for nature and, and help spread awareness about uh, taking care of our, our environment. So, uh, some of the things that we're involved with is uh, raising awareness is very important. Raising awareness, uh, social media through social media. Uh, and of course fundraising that's very important and uh, events like this um, you know we get to be part of events like this and just to help spread awareness about the environment so the ambassadorship of WWF it's lots of lots of things yeah. how about the, the rock chocolate the rock chocolate uh, this is a wonderful tie-up that we have with Edsa Shangri-La the hotel chain and they're selling chocolates uh, produced locally and 10% of the profits go to uh, WWF and supporting our, um, you know, all our project sites and, and going back into WWF and just helping out with the environment. Yeah. What should we do? Is there any season that um, we just get talent? Oh no, well we're still waiting on Asia's Got Talent, uh, so that's coming up soon. So right now, of course, I'm working on my local show uh, on GMA News TV, which is called Ampinaka. Yeah, and uh, I've been afforded time to travel now, so which is great. So taking advantage of the free time to do a lot of traveling and um, and promoting, of course, my uh, advocacy for WWF. So yeah, it's 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 great. Um, but yeah, I miss being busy and, and I can't wait to be busy again. They, they want Mark and I back, so it would be uh, our honor to go back and host Asia's Got Talent. Um, and we're so proud of the Philippines, you know. Philippines has done very well on that show and uh, yeah, we can't wait to be a part and witness it all firsthand again. So yeah. Okay, thank you.